First up in some breaking news just coming in, the Code of Arbitration for Sport or CAS will be hearing Vinesh Fogart's appeal against her disqualification in a short while from now in Paris. Now, ahead of that hearing, the sports, edit, our sports editor Digvijay Singh Dio has accessed the petition. Fogart has filed seeking relief and a shared silver medal from the women's 50 kilogram freestyle event. Fogart stormed into the final of the competition on the 6th of August and was to face America's Sarah Hildenbrat on August 7th, but he was she was sensationally disqualified and stripped of her guaranteed medal after failing to meet the required weight on the morning of the 7th of August. Fogart was found to be 100 grams overweight uh, during the official weigh-in. Fogart's petition has been accepted by the CAS and is against the decision of the United World Wrestling to disqualify her. The International Olympic Committee is also a party to this case, while the Indian Olympic Association is assisting Fogart as an interested party. The competition rules state a weigh-in is a must. Fogart's legal team says she made the first weigh-in and fought three bouts to reach the finals. Her body needed to hydrate and needed nutrition for the purposes of her health. The team says the distance between the venue and the Olympic village was not her responsibility and it affected her ability to start the process of losing weight for the day. Digvijay Singh Dio, our sports ed editor, is joining us live for the very latest on this. And Digvijay, while well, you've been breaking this news for us from day one, tell us a little bit more about the petition and what it says. Well, we had sketchy details of the petition that Vinesh forgot and in fact asked for... Uh, that silver medal to be shared. She initially asked to be able to play in the in the gold medal match. That was not allowed. But the details that I've got now are on the fundamentals of integrity of the competition and the integrity of her health. So we know that Vinesh Fogart was 100 grams overweight uh, in that 50 kg weigh in Bhairavi. But the petition which they are gone to cast with, the hearing starts in about uh, 30 minutes from now. What they've said is that Vinesh was not responsible for that excess weight, that her body needed to hydrate. She needed nutrition to ensure that she was healthy all through that process. They are quoting fundamental rights and they are saying that this is not a case of fraud, that in this case, the weight that she gained was what she needed to sort of uh, ensure that she was healthy during the first day of the competition when she reached the final and then the next morning, there was the distance between the village where she stays, the Olympic village in Sardini, uh, and the competition venue, which is right below the Eiffel Tower, is also a long way off. It was not, uh, she was not responsible for that distance, that she had to travel all the way across from uh, uh, the Eiffel Tower venue to the village to start the process of losing the weight. And they also say that you, can, uh, you cannot say that this was a fraud committed, this was clearly an athlete whose body responded in a very, very different way. So the, this is the crux of the entire petition. They're obviously asking for the medal to be restored. And the hearing are on those four lines. Now, the case is against the United World Wrestling, whose rules in this competition are being followed. They set the rules as the parent body of, 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 uh, of wrestling worldwide. Also... Right. The National Olympic Committee has been made a party. Mm -hmm. That's because the IOC conducts the medal ceremonies. The IOC awards the medals, the diplomas, and, and whatever else comes with it with being an Olympic medalist. The Indian Olympic Association is part of it as an interested party. Okay. So now this appeal was filed by Vinesh Fogart. Yeah. And the IOA has two uh, legal experts, Harish Salve and Vidish Singhania, who are going to assist uh, those law legal teams in this in this hearing okay for all the latest news download the vion app and subscribe to our youtube channel